Hi, everybody. This is Jeffrey. This is Red Color. This is the weekly reading for the collective <clears throat> for the week of April 3rd through the 9th. Good thing I had the calendar there. I used to write everything down and then I'd misplace the page and be like, oh my God. Um, how are you serving yourself? That's a little, it's a question. It's more than a message. Sometimes it's a message. Sometimes on occasion, it's a question. How are you serving yourself? So, are you taking time for yourself? Are you um, putting things in your body that, do, that are good for your body? Are you surrounding yourself with love, with support, with uh, comfort? How are you serving yourself? Mm hmm. This so did not shuffle. So I'm just sort of shoving them together. <laughs> Let me try again. All right. It's a question. What am I doing to take care of myself? What am I doing to bring more comfort, more joy, more um, ease into my life? Sometimes I'm a little philosophical. I had a really lovely day today. My neighbor invited me to uh, a dance, a uh, traditional Mexican dance, um, I don't know, event. It was really lovely. It was really lovely. Uh, it was lovely. Hmm. All right, I'm going to have that. Close the door. I sort of closed it. It's sort of not closed. Okay. I have the seven. Well, the chariot. The king of swords. And the ten of cups. So, I asked the question. I think you're going to have an answer. And I think it's going to be really clear about how you can make yourself satisfied. How you can make your dreams come true. How you can feel part of a community. And it's really about being emotionally sated, Right. And uh, we have the chariot and the chariot, the chariots are really, I always say that we're interesting. Yeah. Well, they're all interesting, you know, truthfully. So the chariot is a seven, it's, it's confidence. There's an element of luck. I always read it as luck. It's part of cancer, really intuitive. Um, has this energy of uh, youth, this energy of, um, enthusiasm and confidence and I'm going to go out and do something I've never done before but I'm confident it'll happen and get done and uh, I have everything I need and I'll figure it out as I go along there's a lot of that going on. a lot of that going on I'll figure it out as I go along and he moves really quickly so maybe after I ask the question it's like well you know maybe I need to eat better maybe I need to sleep better maybe I need to uh have time for a creative outlet, have time to take walks, have time to read, have time to um, make more time for the people I love, for the things that I love. And it's like, okay, I'm making space. I'm making space and I'm taking the show on the road. I'm, I have confidence that I'm going to be able to implement my plan. And you know, it's really interesting too, I always get this feeling of like he's an astronaut. So there's an element of going to a place you've never gone before. And I think the place you've never gone before, this is sort of the part, the other part of the mini message, which is it's not just a question, but it's kind of this energy of I have to serve myself first. That's what it is. I have to serve myself first. I have to serve my own desires and needs and comfort and finances and etc first surgeon because it's self-nurturing and self-caring and practical i know where to plant the seeds i know how to spend the time i, I know how to be patient i know how to um make things grow 
I know how to um, handle my finances. I know how to handle my security. I know what needs to be fed. I know it needs to be fed. What part of me needs to be fed? And I mean, I get both of these. So it's like, and I'm going to act on it. And I'm going to act on it. And, you know, it's it's sort of a mental thing, and but it could also be like a message. And it's like, the time to act is now. There's that energy. So this one I get, um, I get a lot of things. It's a nine, it's attainment. I mean, he sort of feels stuck in a way, but it's also, it's attainment of one's creativity. And, you know, sometimes when we're kind of like, surrounded or in a box or something it's like well i really have to pay i really have to make something let's say but you know i'm going to be practical like i don't have enough money to go buy all this new stuff so i'm going to look around and see what i got or i'm going to get back to that project that i thought i was going to do months ago and it's like i'm really going to dig into it because it'll bring me joy right yeah i'm really going to get into it i'm really going to go because there's an energy in this card of that Martha and the Vandella song. <clears throat> nowhere to run, nowhere to hide, right? Because it's attainment. So it's like, it's like once you get that, cl that clarity about how you can take care of yourself and how you haven't been taking your care of yourself, it's like, okay, enough is enough. Enough is enough. You know, sometimes you put things off for a really long time. And there's an energy in, in, in this week for this reading so far of enough is enough. You know, uh, you know, like I mean to go on a diet and like now even like the fat pants don't fit. Right. Or, you know, it's like that. It's like, okay. Now it's like, I'm not going out and buying a new wardrobe. because the stretch pants don't fit, you know, like that. It's like, okay, enough is enough. I've got to get serious. I've got to get serious. But there's a lot of energy behind you and a lot of um, confidence, a lot of confidence. Well, I mean, you know, for the most part, it's still really the beginning of the year in a way. So like, yeah, yeah, spring is here. Summer's coming. I'm planting new seeds. They're going to come to fruition in the summer, so to speak, or the fall. And it's like, okay, well, enough is enough. You know, it's time to get off my you-know-what and, you know, take an action. So I have the Knight of Swords and the Chariot, and they really move. All right. Um, extended readings are available to members, $4.99 a month. Please join. And that allows you to watch the extended readings for all the elements. And um, have a lovely week. See you soon. Blessings.